Gamers Nightly News. Tonight's topic is Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Ooh. Get the controller now. How's it going, guys? Uh, Your host for tonight is Mexican Ninja. I have the reins. Of I the have the power. And I'm, I'm going to try to talk him <laughs> yeah. through this. So, yeah. uh, it's, like, it's like I'm giving birth and he's like telling me everything to do. Breathe. What? I'm, I'm the altered gamer, by the way, since Don't none of the rest of the people. I'm the cosmic GPS. I'm the, the cosmic GPS. I'm the Mexican ninja with the Pikachu Nintendo 64. Pikachu! Alright, so go ahead and uh, there you go. So, what you're gonna want to do, uh, there's the Sculptula in front of you. There is? It's like, it's hearing. It's, it's kind of hard to explain, but. Uh, oh, yeah, there it is. There he is. Oh. So, you're gonna want to kill him. No, you're gonna you can only hit him in the back. So you're gonna wanna like tempt him like lure him down and then wait for him to turn oh, around. Shit, let him go. See if you do that he's just gonna keep doing that. So you're gonna like wanna lure him down. And not get hit by him. Yeah, uh uh no, not, turn around, turn around. Turn around. And then you're gonna wanna hit him either with a slingshot or do a sword. Turn around. No. So like now. Yep. And you're gonna wait. Uh, though those take two hits to kill right now, you know, once you get better equipment, uh, it only takes one. Alright. Uh, so now what you're gonna wanna do, you're gonna wanna climb up those vines over there. Maybe get that heart. Maybe get that heart. Climb up those vines and get onto that platform that we, we used when we got hit. Drop down. Um... Okay, so now turn around. Oh. And... Hit that switch that's over to the right. Now you want to go do some platforming back over to where that skull tool was. And jump on through there. Now, I don't think there's anything worthwhile in the chest, but this spider here is worthwhile. Or worthwhile. So this is a gold skull chill. There's a hundred of them in the game. Um, for the first, for the, every ten up to fifty, you get a reward from a certain house that we see later in the game. And then for a hundred, you pretty much just get a limited money. So, um... We're gonna at least get 50 during this run. You pimp walking up there? Yeah, you know that was. I was pimp walking up to it. So we're gonna get a, at least 50 in in this run. All right. Um, but we'll probably get more. Now, if memory serves, there's like five rupees in that. Is chest. there anything in there? I oh. think there's five rupees. Well, we need as many rupees as we can get. Oh. <laughs> I feel like if you're, I don't know. Okay, so now you can go back to the door. All right. What is... Okay. What's in my pocket? What's in my pocket? Alright, so now you're going to want to equip a Deku stick. So, push pause. Pause the uh, Equip a Deku stick. Left. Push the Z. It's or okay. R multiple times. I'm just... Go over to the Deku stick. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Go over to the Deku stick. Okay. And... and put it on one of the C buttons. Hi. There you go. Now push C left. Now go light the stick on fire. Oh, okay. No. And then you light the torch. This is a very common puzzle in this game. Uh, if you can even call it a puzzle. So, pretty much a way to save sticks is to like slash a sword. And that's gonna help you save your, save oh, your nice. sticks. Interesting. Glitch? Maybe. Essentially, yeah. So now we're gonna wanna do... Uh, uh, the Skulltulas all have respawned in this room. Because you remember when I killed one on yeah. the way up? They've all... I mean, all three of them are here, so you're just going to want to have- you only need to kill one. They're all, like, in the gaps of the cobwebs. They're right here. Yeah. So I just wait for them to turn around and shoot them in the butt. That's actually or in the mouth. They're, like, in the mouth. So there you go. And now what you're going to want to do is you want to jump down onto that cobweb that's on the very bottom. And if you land on it, you'll break through it and you'll go down to the basement. And you'll try not to die. And you try not to die. Well done. Nice. Could have I missed on purpose? Uh, yeah, you can miss. I've, I've done it. <laughs> and I've yeah. seen gameplay of people missing. How could anybody miss it? It's like, oh, no, I don't miss it. Alright, so now... Uh... Do you have to set another stick on fire? Yeah, pretty much you're going to want to go across there. Okay. And you can see there's like a lighter part of the floor. Yeah. Now before I forget, there is actually another Skulltula right there. Oh, The gold okay. one that we're going to want to get. Yeah, let me get that. There's a platform you can stand on that's... Yeah, I know. I actually 
Oh well. And there's actually one underwater, and you're gonna need that. So you got that, the second gold skull tour. Oh, and, like, getting 50 is actually really easy. I, I pretty much always have 50 by the time I hit the Shadow Temple, mm. which we'll see when we... Which your brother keeps messing up on. Which my brother keeps messing up on, but now that, he's, now that this is going to get uploaded, he's going to get really mad at me for saying that. Alright, so, okay, now turn around. Sorry, I was I forgot to give direction. Drop down. Oh, okay. Because you can't, like, climb over the So turn around. And there's a platform right there on your right. No, why did he climb up? Oh, oh, I, see, that, I, I see it, okay. Uh, and there's a skull shell there on that grate. You know, for some reason, I think I'm playing on the Wii U, and I want to use my controller like, to aim. Yeah, see, I've played the... I've actually played the 3DS version of this game more than this one, uh -huh. so I, sometimes I want to like, do that. Now, to get this one, it's kind of weird. You have to go over to that platform on the right and climb up, and, just and you, you have to jump to it. Oh, this is going to be fun. There you go. Nice. Mid-air stop. Everything else is moving except for Link. Mm -hmm. It's like in the Link to the Past when you climb up the stairs and the entire game stops. <laughs> like time stops because you're going upstairs. All right, so we're going. To, you're going to want to hit that switch. It's right there. Oh, and that's going to burn that cobweb and that's going to light that torch on fire. But how do I get over there without? All right, so you si okay. So push C. Oh yeah, you can open that. Uh, maybe that's rupees? a recovery heart. Oh. Yeah, another recovery heart. Okay, so go over to the edge of the platform, like right there. And push C up. And look down to the right. You, the, you see where it's like oh, a lighter okay. color? That's yeah. actually a platform. So it's, I have to walk it's up off jump. the floor. Yep. Alright. Yep, you got it. And you're gonna do the same thing with the burning sticks. This is more like a talk through at this point. Yeah. <laughs> this is this is more challenging than like oh, explaining no. than explaining a game at through gameplay, because I have to tell them what the, Okay, so go on through the door. And in here, there's a Deku Baba, so shield up. Push R. It's R for a shield. Oh, I should have okay. said that. I didn't give any instruction on uh, Z target him. I, mean, I didn't give any instruction on how to play this game. So run up to him. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Now, what he's going to say is important. He'll teach you something cool. Shoot nuts? You will never be. <laughs> Not in this game. Um, <laughs> unless you punish them in the proper order. Take that as you will. The order is 2, 3, 1. 23 is number 1. Oh, and we'll, nice. we'll remember that. I mean, it's pretty easy to remember, but you need to remember it for like the last room of this dungeon. So. Oh, so. How long is this dungeon? Uh, it's pretty short. It's not the longest. Now, uh, this eye puzzle, and this is one that has showed up a lot in especially 3D Zeldas. Do you want to shoot it? Pull out a projectile and, and shoot the eye. Oh, okay. And I, think, I actually think Half-Life 3 was actually confirmed today. Was it? Like, not nah, even a joke. Yeah, I saw it somewhere. Uh, it might have been a joke, but... I can't right now. Alright, so now this room. This room is fun. Jump into the water. Oh, okay. Not, not on the platform? Nope, don't oh, jump on that talk platform. To me. Do not jump on that platform. Oh, okay. see, and this is hard, because you kind of have to do the timing of it, right? So you're going to want to jump into the water and go over to the left side of the room. Under, underwater. Oh yeah, diving's kind of weird in this game. So go over there. You can see there's a switch over there in front of that grate. And what you're going to want to do, you're going to want to dive down and push that switch down. It's kind of hard to control and it's kind of touchy, but... It is. Holy crap. But sometimes it's also... It's kind of weird because sometimes it's really touchy, but sometimes it's really forgiving. No, so I'm... this is going to lower the water level. So now you're going to want to go back to the platform where we came in. Nope, I have to. Okay. And it's kind of because, like... It doesn't stay down for very long, so you kind of have to be quick about it. You can hear it's ticking. So you're going to like jump on that platform and crouch down, push R, push R, push R. There you go. And Ooh. now jump the rest of the way. Nice. Oh! And now the sculpture here, you just kill him like the rest of them. Okay. So I'm going to turn around and jump in the butt. Show me that. And there you go. Now you're going to go up to that box, and Nobby's going to tell you about pushing boxes. I think I've played this game a few times. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, it's kind of similar to Victor's Mask. It's very similar. Well, game kind of. of. Gameplay, yeah, gameplay-wise, it's identical, really, but... Except for masks. Yeah. 
So you're gonna to wanna to push that box with that awesome camera angle and push it to the end of its track. The camera angles. No. Well, it is. I've done it yet. It is the. I mean, this really is the prototype for 3D adventure games. It is. And ever since this game, Zelda games has only gotten better. Yeah, of course. Alright, so in this room, you're gonna to wanna to light all the torches. Now you can kill this guy, Kubala, but he does respawn, I believe. But I mean, that's that's honestly fine because you can hold 10 sticks anyway. So, so light the two torches. There you go. And go on through that door. Attack! Slash the shield. Alright, now kill him. Now you can shoot him down right now because he's not going to turn around. Oh, did I just shoot my hand? Okay, now before you go rushing in, you see those three things on the ceiling? Should I shoot them? Okay, there's two methods. One is to shoot them all down, the other one is to avoid the middle of the room. I'll just shoot them. Okay, that didn't work. <laughs> oh, what happened? Okay, I'm not good with aiming, so... Is that good? Yeah, yeah, that should be good. No. A little higher. The, like I said, the aiming is kind of right touchy, there. and the... Uh, like I said, also this is like the prototype um, for... Right there. Yeah. Okay. Right. And something that they fixed in the 3DS version is they gave you like kind of like a sight on your on your slingshot, mm -hmm. so it makes it easier. Oh, yeah. So what you're gonna do okay. behind that set of cobwebs, there's nothing like we can't access it yet. Okay. So there's no point in doing that yet. Uh, but across the room, right in front of you, right, there's there. a set of cobwebs. You're gonna want to burn them down. All right. And I'm sure the viewers are all wondering what if we accomplish? Well, we we just went in a big circle. We did. Slash the sword. Go into that hole. Zoom in. And essentially what we did, we went in a big circle, but now we're slightly higher than we were before. Uh, what? It's kind of weird. So you remember that room that you fell into? This is the same room, except that oh, we're okay. higher we're on another floor. So now push that, that box down. Push it all the way down. Good. That was good. Audience, how was your weekend? Terrible? Good. Pizza? No, I'm just kidding. I didn't have anything to do this weekend. So, I mean, when I got news from some schools that I was getting some decent money from them, that made me that was pretty good. Alright, so now you're going to want to do the same thing. You're going to want to light the, light the stick on fire. And now you're going to want to jump over. You missed the fire. And then you're going to want to jump over to that box that you just pushed down. Oh, okay. And then you're gonna wanna like roll over the cobweb, so push A right now. Push A, push A, push A. There you go. Drop down. Oh, I thought that was ground for a second. So did I. I was like, oh, he's gonna die. <laughs> Alright, so remember the 23 is number one? Yep. There's three Deku scrubs in here. You're gonna wanna kill. You're gonna wanna kill them in the right order. You already screwed up. I did? Yeah. So there's yeah, three of them, them, there's three of them, uh -huh. and there's an order to them, so you kill the second one, then the third one, then the first one. Oh, okay, okay. So, but so, since you screwed up, you yeah. need to like redo it. It's easier if you Z target them. I did. Well, yeah, you're you you have like zero block. There you go. All right, so now they're gonna like reset. Yeah, so, so now you kill, go for the second one. And sometimes it's. Now the third one? It's just that one? Yeah, it's that one on the right. Oh, okay. Alright, now for this last one, after you hit him back with his nut, you have to... <laughs> you have to, like, get back. You have to attack him quickly, because if not, they'll reset. You have to do it again. So, you gotta... Come back like, you can't let him fall. You can't let him get back into his hole. And he got back in. He got back into his hole, so you have to do it again. Okay, that's great. Alright, no, you just have to get him again. You just have to get him again. I think, for some reason I thought you like, you did it, but yeah, there's a thing over I think you good. can just stand there, like stand in front of this thing, and he'll... Yeah, there you go. Queen Gama. Queen Goma. Goma? Gama? Goma. It's, it's, I believe it's pronounced Goma. Okay. They just never say it. Yeah, so strike her, strike with, strike her with your sword when she's stunned. Okay. 
I don't know if you want me to do this boss fight. Or... Oh, it's about to be a boss fight. Right now? Yeah, we're about to go into a boss fight. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll see if I can do it. I'll probably fail, but. All right, so we go on in the door. How do I summon with the? Yeah, so pretty much you're gonna want to share with the eye in the eye with your two seeds. Uh oh, that's not good. No, you can. I believe you can pick up more <laughs> in the room. That's oh, perfect okay. timing. Wait, it's been 15 minutes now? What was that? Has it been time? I don't know. Yeah, it's, it's been time, stop. It's 8.29. Pause the game, there. So, I mean, it's been like 15. Yep, 15 minutes. Alright, so, uh, I'm doing this now. Alright. So, you just want to end the video right here? The controller's been passed, and I'm screwed over. I should be able to do this really quickly. Alright, go ahead. Oh, man, it's dark. It is dark, and that's actually something it's I... It's dark. It's dark. That's actually something I don't like about this game is that the, the lighting is. Are you bad. gonna find are you gonna find Bane in there? So you just go, man. Oh crap. I actually have been able to beat this boss very quickly in the 3DS version, but not in this one. That is one adorable boss. <laughs> <laughs> With two, uh. Deku stuff? Die in a mist! I need more hooks. I need more seeds. I need more seeds. We're trying to kill those nuts. No, thanks. Thanks, Dave. I appreciate it. Now that we don't need any movies, we get them. There we go. Deku's used. Deku! Deku, 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 Deku. Deku! Deku! Oh, so remember those things that I had you shoot off the ceiling? That That's what the... these are. Uh. Oh, don't blink. Oh, well, technically you don't have to blink, but blink in this game. Alright, that works for me. Alright, now that I have Deku 2, do I have one or seven? Uh, that's a one. Okay. Yeah, I should be good. If I can get this shot, I'll be good. And I missed. <laughs> is, that, is that your phone? Gosh dang it. Yeah, but not mine. There we go. Does it make sense? Kevin, you really do. Um, yeah. Yeah, they're kind of weird. No, actually, in uh, the Master Quest version, there was a buttload of those guys. Oh, this is it? This should, like, if I can do this right, this should be good. Yeah, you missed One, you shoot him. Two, uh, there we go. This is it. That's it. One. Bang, there we go. Nice. Thank you. Nice. What? Oh. Nice. So there we go, that, that is the first dungeon of Ocarina of Time. And they only get better, so. I can't wait. There's a heart container. So, I guess with this. With this, I'm gonna jump on in here. Oh, nice. Teleporting. Teleport out. Teleport. Yep, just going. And, yep, uh, away. yeah. You might wanna cut the video because my people gonna, need me. There's gonna be a cutscene. Alright, so, so, when in doubt, live life. Thank you.